Wi-Fi Ranger, which is called the Elite Pack. So we've studied this system a little bit, and we uh, saw that Gone with the Winds was using it and some other folks. And we decided to go ahead and purchase it and put it on our unit. Internet is critical to Shuri and I because of the blogs and all the websites. And, of course, of doing our videos constantly. So the one thing you got to realize when you buy the Wi-Fi Ranger <clears throat> is what kind of antenna you want. So, um, before I even tell you all that, the Wi-Fi Ranger is a repeater system that is for internet connections or free Wi-Fi. So it reaches out up to two miles to find free internet that may be available. I've even heard that when you're in a RV place that may have internet just in the clubhouse, I've heard that they've able uh, people have been able to uh, connect to that clubhouse even from out in the field. So uh, we're looking forward to uh, uh, having that system in. So when we put the Wi-Fi Ranger in, you have two types of antennas. You have a straight up and down one, and you have a flush mount one, which is L-shaped. Uh, we chose the flush mount one because um, we didn't want to put it on our antenna. But if you got the, the straight one, you could install it on your TV antenna that goes up and down and just put it on here. Or you can uh, put a pole in the back of your rig and actually strap it onto a pole and put it off your ladder. Um, and, or you can get the flush mount like we got, which goes flat on your, your, your roof and is L-shaped. So that's the system we picked. So we had that installed by Camping World. And we actually had all of our work done by Camping World because I am an electrician. Um, however, my, I'm strapped for time and I really wanted to make sure that it got done right. And it's guaranteed. So I had them, uh, Camping World do it and, and they did a great job. The second thing that was really important is we put the receiver at the end of our island in our kitchen of the fifth wheel. We did have the choice of putting it on the wall in a hallway and I was concerned that we may interfere with the signal and so I had them put it down at the uh, at the end of our island and I'll show you a picture of that right now. And it it's I like where it's at. It's uh, out of the way. It's not an eyesore. It was uh, and it points right into our living room. Uh, I come to find out, I talked to the company that makes the Wi-Fi Ranger, and they said it would have been just fine there. So, but we have to power a couple laptops and a wireless printer, and just wanted to make sure it worked. So uh, we're just being cautious. So after that, you turn it on, and it puts out a uh, a code that you can see uh, when you look at your wireless connections. So the next thing you need to do is get your laptop out, look for that connection and connect to it, and then open up MyWiFiRanger.com and then you have a control panel. In that control panel was kind of interesting. Uh, we went to an RV park that had so-so internet on it and when it scanned using just the receiver inside the unit it found 10 Wi-Fi stations, I'll say that. Then when we went to the Elite and told it to use the antenna up above, it actually found 15. So it did do a reach out. So the other thing is once we connected um, to those and got on the internet, we also had to do a firmware upgrade, which is pretty normal. That was a piece of cake. You just hit a little button that says firmware upgrade and it just does it and then it reboots. So the other thing is, in this RV park in Anacortes, I have to tell you, it was the fastest internet I've ever had in an RV park once I was connected. I'm not sure if the Wi-Fi Ranger actually boosted the signal or what it did, but it was outstanding. So our first test of the RV... Uh, <laughs> the Wi-Fi Ranger is awesome. I love it. So if you all want to get your own Wi-Fi Ranger, you now have the opportunity to get it through our site at RV Travel Buddy. Go to our product reviews, and you can uh, get 5% off 
on your purchase of the Wi-Fi Ranger. Just click on the link, use the code that we put in there, um, and when you make your purchase, you'll save you a good chunk of money. So, anyway, we were very happy with that system.